Raj, Mr. Raja Gopalan, Gagan Sethi says one. There can be the other argument that you, when you Anna get into politics, no, no, politics, politics cannot be a double cushioned sofa. It's going to be sometimes also include. You know, you're going to have to sit on a seat of thorns. It's go, you're going to have to take the good with the bad, Mr. Raja Gopalan. However, your response to what Gagan Sethi says, he says the language of political discourse in Gujarat, the nature of the campaign is so negative. Yeah. So negative that Rahul Gandhi did not want to participate in it. Arana, first of all, I want to ask you, I am not going to yield to anyone. If they <laughs> want to ask me any question, they should wait for that turn. <laughs> okay. Only one is important. I want to say, election is meant for in and those. Election is meant for heating up the discussion. Election is meant for to heat, create a hype in everyone. They have to put forth one. It has to be a spontaneous one, extempore one. It should not be a, a written speech or like that. If you see any political leader, Mr. Karnanidhi or Ms. Jalalita or anyone for that matter, it's an extempore one. Whereas Rahul Gandhi today failed to enthuse the cadre as well as the electorate. That is what I feel at least. Number one, when he went to Tamil Nadu, he did not even visit Karnanidhi. He went to election campaign in Kerala. He created a fuss about Tamil baby type. And wherever he goes for the campaign, now it is high time that he should get tutorials if he is going to have 2014 or 13 projected as a prime ministerial candidate, he should do at least do some homework. He should not be going like this. Responses. Because he is a tall leader of Congress party. Yielding to I me. Yielding to me. One second. We have two, three responses. No, one second. My question to you is, my question to you is, list of star campaigners released by the Congress party, November 27th, lists Rahul Gandhi as one of the star campaigners. Absolutely. So what happened to the star campaigner? Absolutely. Why was he, where was the star campaigner? One minute, one minute. Let me tell you, oh, the, take a this, is, this is a well-orchestrated campaign. This Who? is Fox. Let, let me tell you. No, did the Congress Narendra party make him a star campaigner or the BJP make him a star campaigner? One minute, one minute. No, did the Congress party make him a star campaigner? Firstly, I'm delighted that Minakshi Lekhi wants to be a political advisor to the Congress, she's welcome. Answer the my point, question. No, the point I'm going to make is, Rahul Gandhi's <laughs> visit today and the entire campaign of the Congress, it looking at ignoring the personality, bringing out issues, talking about development, exposing the fact that this campaign, this is the Rahul Gandhi's main theme today. Right. Arnab, so India you, Shining 2004, Arnab, we saw what Arnab. the verdict was. Are you saying this, this is Gujarat I, I, Shining 2012. I want, this is what Rahul Gandhi is exposed to, I, today. I, I, I am only curious to know. This is nothing but a hype and Arnab, a rasmata. I, 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 I only want to know. The common Arnab, people of Gujarat have suffered. They Devang Nanavati responded. Devang Nanavati, go ahead. I don't know where. This is about politics of governance, not about politics of personality. Which is what Mr. Modi is obsessed with. Thank you. Devang. Arnab, it is quite shameful that Mr. Sethi is insulting the people of Gujarat, that the Gujarat people only love inundos and don't care for serious issues in election. That is an insult. Let him respond, Mr. 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 Sethi, after him. After him. After him. No, no, don't respond. I still I have not yet yielded. I have not yet yielded. Mr. Mr. Sethi is not yielded. In the beginning of the show, that, 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 that what that what words, you said I'm on the beginning of the show that the UP election results, the Bihar election results have shown that don't, how dangerous it is for Mr. Rahul Gandhi to campaign or to campaign more. A, therefore, they have to okay, gentlemen, I'm going to, I'm going to turn the volume off a bit. That if Rahul Gandhi goes there, his name will be spoiled. The result in Gujarat is already written on the wall. We are going to come back with a two-thirds majority, and that's the verdict of the people of Gujarat. And it is very I sad want to ask that Congress and other NGOs supporting Congress are now trying to say that the people of Gujarat like a particular kind of campaign and are not serious in election issues. No, no, what's, 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 my, my question is, Sanjay, 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 please, Sanjay, please. No, my, my question is, my question to the BJP, my question to the BJP is, what is Modi talking about, Meenakshi Lekhi? There will be an argument that it is Modi better, one second, let, do you want to listen to my question? There will be an argument put, it is better to be absent from a campaign like Rahul Gandhi was, then be irrelevant to the campaign, like Narendra Modi can be accused of being, because all his issues he addresses were issues around the center, like inflation, corruption. He did not talk about Mayamben Kodnani. He didn't talk about the drought condition in Kutch Saurashtra. He did not talk about the plight of the tribals. He doesn't refer to state issues in a state election. Is that not irrelevance? Meenakshi Lekhi.
No, uh, no, I'm no. Not, I, I, yes, I'm coming to it. Narendra Modi has successfully mixed the central issues, the national issues, along with the state issues. And I can quote from the certain rallies. One rally I attended was at Rajkot, where he discussed the pipeline, giving PNG gas to people, and how Congress government has stalled supplying the gas and how the petition is pending in the Supreme Court. The second issue which was raised was about water, how the state government has been declined or no order is coming from the centre government on putting the gates so that the water overflow which is going into the sea can be stopped and the water can be given to Saurashtra saying this is the water no. requirement and water is getting wasted. Allow us to complete that. He talks about roads because Mrs. Gandhi tried to talk about roads. In Keshore, Ami uh, uh, Ami Rally, he talked about no. the no, 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 no. He talked yes. about the pricing. He talked about Mengai. No, no, you, he, you, you. No, no. About so, no, my question was, isn't and, it better? And, and I think is this it better kind of to be irrelevant. No, no, what's yeah, my question? Irrelevant subject I, because they know I, they have I failed on development Kinaxi issue Singh. so Kinaxi they try and bring 2002 to constantly to so failure to add to what Minakshi is saying, he spoke about the one Bandhu Kalyan scheme which has been done for the tribal welfare. He has spoken about the Mission Mangalam scheme which is what is doing about women. He has pointed out that government of Garib. India's own record shows that 70%, 70% of the unemployment exchange employment provided is in Gujarat in the past five years. So what are you talking about? Yeah, that is one second, one second. One second. I, my counter to that. My counter to that. Please, 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 Sanjay. I'm sorry, unlike, unlike Rahul Gandhi, his speeches have been one hour long. One second. The, it could equally be argued that Wiley so says Let Ami Agnik of the Congress it. Party respond to that to, to, the, to your point there. He didn't talk about his family alienation. Congress responding to you. Minakshi Lekhi and Devang Nanavati. Please listen on. Yes. Yes, please go ahead. Ami. And now there are only personal uh, personalized attacks by the Chief Minister to whatever meetings are held by top national leaders. There is no decorum of any me in any meetings, no answer given, no accountability given, and you go on challenging certain uh, uh, issues. But when the leaders at the local level, at the state level, asked him to come out for a debate, Arjun Bhai Modwadia ji and Shakti Singh ji, Goel asked him to come on a platform, discuss these issues, ah. explain to the people of people. He did not come. Ah. In the assembly, the assembly I worked only for I... 25 days. No debate was encouraged. And in the last 10 years, in 3,650 days, only 365, I think in 304 days, Mr. the Raja assembly Gopala. has won. Mr. Raja Gopalan, the, the Congress Party answer. says... The he Congress does not give any answer okay, to the people, so only the, makes personalized attacks. Okay, okay, so the Congress Party says don't complain because when I we think. want to engage you in a debate, you run away. You don't debate with Shakti Singh Goel and Arjun Modwadia. <laughs> Do you expect to debate with Rahul Gandhi and Sonia Gandhi in a Gujarat election? Mr. Raja Gopalan, answer the Congress. <laughs> Rahul Gandhi and Sonia Gandhi don't speak Congress, in the parliament. What will they debate about? Raja Congress does not have a we focus on the legislative assembly. Congress does not have a focus on the election speeches. Yeah, that is why the entire thing. They should at least rehearse. They should at least uh, uh, focus on what is the issue they are going to speak in the Gujarat assembly elections. They have not done that. You know that is a homework they should do very well. Neither Madam Sonia Gandhi nor Prime Minister nor Rahul Gandhi, they are not at all doing that. Let him come in. The questions were very clear. You are unable to answer. The Chief Minister has not answered a single question. In many of the editorials today, editorial newspapers of today, they say Rahul Gandhi should focus it on his whatever he wants to have it said. He should focus it very well, articulate the subject very well. But My he failed to do that what, in Gujarat during his seven-hour election campaign. Don't you think, one second, don't you think, uh, 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 Sabah, that for all that you, is being said by the Congress, there is a section of the Congress party which will be polite about Rahul Gandhi's, you know, careful calibration into where he goes, what he goes, when he says, and protecting him from, you know, political onslaught. There is a section of the Congress party which wants to see Rahul Gandhi go ahead, face the bouquets and the brickbats, but at uh, least lead the charge. But that's he's doing One on second. his own. No, not in, inside the party, uh, among uh, the people. Uh, Sabha. Uh, 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 Arnab, uh, Arnab, I think, uh, I think the, the, the Congress has actually... Let's face it, they've been tiptoeing around the personality of Narendra Modi. They have uh, tried to figure out how to deal with it. 
we are told that the tactic is that the top leadership should not utter his name and uh, should not give him an occasion to uh, counter attack now whether that will succeed or not we will know but isn't that being but, overprotective uh, you know so but they have isn't a that being overprotective so uh, i i mean overprotective no uh, it it actually shows uh, uh, protective about rahul I, i can hear you but let me just finish the point i can't hear you that clearly but let me just finish this point so there is no doubt that the congress has been foxed about how to take on mr modi they are tiptoeing around this and we are told that the tactic is that uh, the local uh, leaders are fighting they have come out with the charge sheet which they appear to have i have seen ami agni on your channel so many times and that it is being done at the local level now we still have to see the results of that But, i i uh, i, ag- know, I agree doubt, with you, you know, i agree with you but you know if the, if many people are looking upon this mr gagan said i don't know how you are looking about the amdabad nationally people are saying this is a you know look ahead to what's happening in 2014 now suppose the bjp projects rahul gandhi then rahul gandhi's non appearance in gujarat will be seen to be an unwillingness to take on narendra modi in a one on one battle and whatever we may say you said uh, it's not america it's not personality elections but personalities do matter in a national election mr sethi i'm sure you agree with me on that no i i agree with you and this unfortunate but oratorial skills is not the only asset of a governance <laughs> i mean oratorial skills is one aspect of of uh, leading public life but there are many other ways i, I mean to be, become a good politician what i mean i think uh, we we must understand this that okay. only th- be able to talk and and raise public uh, anger and uh, raise public voices in meetings it's is not, not a reflection about being a good politician okay i i i'll take i'll 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 take, I'll take a quick rebut from minakshi lekhi then a word from you sanjay ja where are where are Ma- the mr. other Sethi, 180 mr mr sethi what is where leadership all about you are inarticulate you are illiterate and you have no policy skills. no vision is this the kind of leadership we discuss uh, do Minister we want uh, to join the cabinet uh, uh, bribery that kind of leadership in the center the which is talking people who are illiterate okay. are ruling the center of india is that is that the leadership we are talking about i am not a congressman i am i am not a congressman i am not trying to be this thing i am only giving you a perspective that good politicians need to be very, just not very good very very flawed perspective and there are many would, would, would you say last question on this news are debate you are last, illiterate you have no vision last, and last, you have no policy matter on policy on this news are debate i am not saying last question, on this, debating. Debating. Saying. Last question <laughs> on this news are debate I because we have a big debate more. coming up I'm on the other side as well gentlemen one ladies and my last question is if last question this is a critical if sanjay jha they would have he would have gone campaign 10 days said a lot of things and even if the congress party had lost do you think there would have been more political honor in that loss well let me tell you there's a big difference i know everybody keeps talking about up in bihar this is a different i didn't election. even mention it this this time. is a congress versus bjp election is different number 2 this is a campaign right. where the local leadership of the congress has been hurting narendra modi for a long time don't forget arnab he's lost some very crucial by elections arun jetli has gone on record to say that saurashtra is a different election and we, gujarat is another one minute they are scared let me tell you 117 and 91 which is a half a mark is not a big number yeah. there is a huge anti incumbency coming up and the last thing on earth you want to do is to yes. give an opportunity to a man who does nothing but attacks rahul gandhi at every opportunity okay. Now, that's and by the way this is a sustained campaign of the congress well thought through is checkmated the bjp rahul can attack back the bjp is but rahul can attack back i think the bjp today is in a state of discomfiture not going okay. how to react to rahul gandhi strategy well well you know when when you attack digvijay singh <laughs> you see the results for yourself when you attack digvijay singh digvijay Singh attacks right back. When you attack Sharad Pawar, Sharad Pawar attacks right back. If they attack Rahul Gandhi, Rahul Gandhi can attack right back. But this may be a unique form of political strategy. My only question is whether it will last till 2014. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for debate number one.